Two Massachusetts communities shaken tonight. Police are investigating three fires at places of worship in a five-day span. All of the fires intentionally set. Eyewitness News reporter Caroline Goggin is live in studio now with the latest developments. Caroline? Well, Shannon and Mike, over the past decade, there have been a total of 21 arson fires at houses of worship in Massachusetts. Now, several local police departments are stepping up patrols due to three recent ones. Two set at the same home in Arlington, another in Needham. While police say no threats were made, these incidents are now being investigated as possible hate crimes. Two fires in five days at a Center for Jewish Life in Arlington, Massachusetts. Police say both fires were intentionally set. This will not deter us. If anything, it, we will double down on our efforts to bring more goodness into the world and create a better world for all of our children. Tonight, Lena Bouquet and her husband, Rabbi Ave Bouquet, are trying to stand strong. The center on Lake Street, where both fires were set, is their home. Now, they're living in fear. This is something which has not just shocked myself and Luna to the core, but it has shocked the entire community. The first fire happened last Saturday. The second broke out last night. Surveillance video from a nearby home captured someone walking by just minutes after that fire was set. These are extremely concerning incidents in which an innocent family has lost the all important sense of safety and security that the home is meant to convey. A similar situation played out Thursday night in Needham. There was some flames underneath. Rabbi Mendy Krinsky, his wife, and five of their eight kids were home when they smelled fire. His wife and kids ran to the car for cover. Opened this door right here and saw flames. So I asked my son to grab the fire extinguisher. We put it out. Thank God it was caught right away. Now, to be clear, police say they are still investigating whether the fires in Arlington are connected to the fire in Needham. The Jewish community is offering a $20,000 reward for any information who could lead to the suspects. I'm Caroline Goggin, Eyewitness News.